Welcome back. In this video, I'm going to show you on how you can get your blind dog to want to play ball with you. So first off, um, this won't work for all dogs, um, just some dogs, blind or not. Some dogs just do not like playing ball. You know, they're very difficult and just, it's just some, some do and some don't. It really depends on their personality, I guess. And um, so Panda here very much loves balls. Um, she just took one and walked away. But um, so some dogs just will not want to play. So so some just I don't know. You can't. But I'm just gonna show you on. Some tricks I did to get my dog interested in playing ball and also this might be a little bit more difficult for um, for actual completely blind dogs because Panda is actually she has one eye missing but she can see completely fine in her other eye so it is it is probably more difficult with a completely blind dog but I'm sure these will work fine so my first step what I'm gonna do is um you're gonna take the ball and just roll it on the ground, see how they react to it. Queen, I already um she she's already obsessed with balls, you know, I've already done this to her. So, you know, she is gonna be a lot different for her. I've been a beginner dog, um, but um so when she started off, I would roll a ball on the ground. She would just like not even knew a ball rolled. She couldn't see it, and so she didn't. She probably heard a little noise, but was a little confused about it. So first off, you're gonna want to make some noise. Um, that's if your dog can hear. Um, you want, if not, then vibration. If your dog blind and deaf, you can do vibration by throwing the ball, hitting the ground or just noise um, with the ball. And so if you begin a dog, let me show you um, how I started off. Basically, I'm just gonna hit the ball to the ground until it bounces, and that way she'll hear the ball bouncing. So after you do that, just see how they react um, to the bouncing ball. See if they are enjoying it. Um, see if they try to chase after it. If not, then there's something else you can do. If you're going to want to try and make it more excited. And so I got, um, so I got something ex like a excited ball. And so I don't have it there right now. Um, he has misplaced it. But she does have a squeaky ball. Something that sounds fun, exciting, and just try to get them want to play with that, and then um, try bouncing that ball, um, and just see if they'll get more interested in balls by by noise from the balls, and then um, you know just bounce it. See that's making noise; she can hear it. And then after a while, even blind dogs might. I mean, sure not all, but might actually be able to tell when you roll it, just from learning. But um, even Panda, when I roll it, sometimes she can't see it. So most of the time, I have to make a little bit of noise. See, she was just a little bit confused with the direction it went. So, um, so try and see if you can get your blind dog, you know, more interested in balls, and I hope this helped you. Be sure to comment if it did, and tips you have for training a blind dog, um, and subscribe for more videos.